Hi all, this is a short video on MEM rhinoscopy. We use MEM to test a common if posture at near, which is how accurate our focusing system is working. It's quite useful in helping us to diagnose and manage a common if virgin's dysfunction. Normally, when we focus on an object, for example, a fixation target, we don't focus exactly at the target itself. We focus a little behind it. This is because of depth of field. The accommodative response is generally less than the stimulus. Our system can do less work, less focusing, and still see the target clearly. Think about it. Why should we do more work when we don't need to? When we focus behind the target, we call this a lag in accommodation. So the normal lag in accommodation is plus 025 to plus 075. You can think about this as how lazy we can be when we're focusing at a target. Testing MEM is easy. You need a retinoscope and you attach your knee fixation card to it. It can be letters, numbers, whatever you like. And the patient should be wearing their full correction at near. The room illumination should be dim, but with the target illuminated, of course. Examine the reflex in the horizontal meridian, swiping across, and then you briefly insert the lenses into the line of sight for a couple of seconds. You then ret the patient until you neutralize the reflex. So basic retinoscopy. If you get with motion, then we're gonna be adding plus lenses and this is a lag of accommodation. If you get against motion, you're gonna be adding minus lenses and you're gonna record a lead of accommodation. Lead is the opposite to lag. In this case, we have to add minus lenses. So we are over focusing. We're doing more work than what's necessary. So we're over accommodating. In this case, we are focusing in front of the target. Here's an example. Let's say for our patient we get with movement and it's neutralized with a plus 150. What does it mean? First of all, we know that it's out of our normal range, which is plus 025 to plus 075, and we know it's a lag because we use plus lenses. So this patient is focusing too far behind the target, so not doing enough focusing in order to see the target clearly. All values higher than plus 075, so a lag in accommodation, may suggest the patient has a knee isophoria because our convergence system is going to try and compensate for the insufficient accommodation. It may mean an accommodative dysfunction such as paresis or fatigue, or maybe even just undercorrected hyperopia or overcorrected myopia. If it's more than two diopters, then this is showing signs of presbyopia. All values below plus 0.25 means a lead of an accommodation, and this can show a knee exophoria, so the opposite of what we said before, spasm of accommodation, or an undercorrected myope. That's it guys, thanks for watching, and please be sure to check out my society's six page FD designs, which has awesome optometry related and eye related merchandise. I've popped the link in the description below, so check it out.